Um, well, it basically has to do with the timing of the um, of the person's uh, particular mental illness. An incompetency proceeding, uh, or when a person is found incompetent, that means that at the present time, as they stand before the court, they are incompetent. That means they cannot understand what the proceedings are about. They do not understand who the judge is. They don't understand who I as attorney am. They don't understand what a plea bargain is. They don't understand what a trial is. Um, and therefore, they're incompetent to proceed to trial. Uh, an insanity uh, proceeding or a person who's maybe found be found not guilty by reason of insanity are, are basically that at the time in which they committed the offense, at the time in which the offense was actually committed or, or done by that individual, they did not have the capacity or the mental capacity to understand what it is that they were doing. Um, and therefore, they did not appreciate the criminal nature of the conduct that they were actually engaged in. So it's really a timing issue. Um, so that's the difference between an insanity proceeding versus a incompetency proceeding.